Welcome to Inkai Reads. It's not my fault. A crappy pasta posted on crappypasta.com. If you don't know what that is, it is where all the pieces of shit go after you submit your piece of shit to Creepy Pasta. And today with us we have Dizzy Paw. Say hello. Hello, everyone. We have had many of a fail, ranging from Smeagol voice to Potato Connection to Dizzy Paw has caught the fucking plague. To all just my bad English, I really need to learn my English. And since you all, (laughs) indeed. So we will now start, and I will read for you. Here we go. Well, one night there were two little girls, Rose Ad and Violet. This man needs to go to a mental hospital, for he is not right in the head. Maybe he has dyslexia. I don't know. Hey, don't offend people here. Why not? It's not like they'll be able to read the text or anything. Okay, continue. Their dad came home after he got drunk and jumped by people in the bar. I don't know what this means. Either he was at a rave and jumping up and down, he found a pogo stick and bounced around a lot, or he was attacked by a gang of midgets on pogo sticks. Oh, fuck yes. There were pogo marks all over his naked body. Don't ask me why he was naked, he just was. Midgets like to rob clothing. No offense to midgets. Ah, uh, they probably won't be tall enough to see over the desk. <laughs> anyway. They'll go right over their head. Ha. Huh. He went up into the girls' room, sat down next to them, and slowly pulled out a gun. That's not good. That's very not good. Especially what if it was a schwung, I mean schlong, English fail, fuck me, anyway. But get all those dirty thoughts out of your head, anyway. They didn't see it because it was beside Violet's head. I don't know how you wouldn't see that considering it's by your head, but anyway. He quickly pulled the trigger after saying it's your fault. Apparently he got a collateral headshot too. Both of the girls dropped to the floor. Wait a minute. Wait, so they were in bed. They stood up with blood shooting out of their head, and they fell to the ground, dying, and then just died there. You know, the normal people, when they're about to die in bed, they stand up, make sure they're dying, and then they fall over. I do that all the time. That's not healthy. Maybe they were on their period. <laughs> period blood everywhere. Bleeding from two places. Ew. Blood poured out of their heads onto the carpet floor. Come get your carpet floor here. Come get a carpet floor in 1999. Covered with brain matter and period. I don't know what a carpet floor is. I guess he meant carpet flooring. I don't know. Or carpet Carpet floor. floor. Maybe. The dad, crying, went downstairs and sat on his leather chair. Leather chair, that's a nice, nice kind of chair. Fuck yeah, leather. He probably got his daughter's blood all over it, though. <laughs> period blood. He covered his eyes and tried to stop crying because he was a little bitch. He then heard footsteps above him. Wow, that's a great direction above. I'm gonna think of that. I love when everything's above me. It's awesome. I know you love it when people are above you and you're on bottom. What? Nothing. In the room he was just in. He then felt a small hand on his shoulder. And then another one on his other shoulder. Shit just got real. The two girls were standing there behind him. Eyes rolled backwards, bleeding. Then two small voices said, It's not our fault. That was the last thing he heard before death. So apparently he was eyeballed to death. I just don't know what went wrong. Either that or he was choking on the strawberry jelly shooting out of their skull. But would that mean he, like, went down on there and, like, started to just eat the stuff? I don't know where I was going with that. I don't know. Should stop talking. I probably should. Probably not any more than I should or whatever. <laughs> anyway, this probably could have been a better story if the person put more thought into it, put some more description, like, why this horrible shitty man wanted to kill his two daughters and why the hell were they sleeping together in the first place why so, the hell was he attacked by midget pogo men that happens day to day it's not uncommon 
Oh, that's true. I forgot about that. Maybe the reason why he wanted to kill them... Actually, he had no reason to kill them, because obviously if they're sleeping together, they had no other beds, because this man was so poor. He wanted more blankets. What do you expect? And he spent his time at the bar, riding on pogo sticks. Or being chased by midgets with pogo sticks. He got pulled over with a DUI with a pogo stick. They had to take his pogo stick, and the midgets just trampled all over him. So terrible. Rest in peace. Wait, yeah, he's dead now. He got, he got eyeballed to death. Uh, obviously a lot of grammar fail, a lot of punctuation fail. Well, speaking fail. Shut the hell up. That's me being. What is that horrible sound? Stop. <laughs> I'm sorry, I was moving my mouth. You are moving your mouth. Your yes. mouth. You're moving your mouse, mouse, and it sounded more like you're fucking making a motorcycle or something. I don't even know. Yeah, I, I do that to my spare time. You know those little motorcycles that midgets have to ride. We are getting uh, way off topic. Yes, we are. Well, it's okay because we already have a bloopers reel. It's going to probably be about two fucking videos as long as it's terrible. It's very terrible. If you would like us to do this again. Or just me, or both of oh, us at the same time. Story. Well, yeah, with a different story. Together, naked, nipples touching. Sweet, then, with marmalade. Ew. Hey, you cannot tell me marmalade is good. You know, I've never had any. But if you like it, then dick slot that like button. Subscribe would be very helpful. Give All that love. usual stuff that people say. And if you just watch and leave without commenting or doing anything, I'll hunt you down and I will slap you in the face with my schlong. Schlong dong. No, I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't he'll do that. He'll, he'll give you a slap on the wrist. Naughty slap. Yes. Anyway, thanks for watching and make sure to watch the bloopers reel because shit will get real.